They come home, they have a snack, they play in their room, they run around the house like normal children. And that wasn't the case Friday. The afternoon routine was anything but usual for the Frosts four days ago. While playing in a room, seven-year-old Emilia was hit by a bullet fired during a drive-by shooting. The Waterville police chief says there were five shots fired in total. Violent crime is always uh, a concern for us, and particularly uh, when it happens to a child. Emilia's mom was understandably overcome with emotion when describing the chaotic moments just after the shooting, when she heard a noise coming from her daughter's room. And I said, you need to call 911. And I picked her up and carried her to the kitchen floor and I put the towel on her to put pressure on her. According to Maine Med, Emilia is now in fair condition. As the search for a suspect continues, the family wants answers. And she just keeps asking, why would somebody do this to me? What did I do wrong? And we keep telling her, you did nothing wrong. You didn't deserve this. Both Waterville Police and State Police are investigating. A lot of leads to follow up on, and uh, we're doing that as thoroughly and as quickly as we possibly can. For the Frosts, it's difficult to come to terms with how quickly and randomly their lives were upended. Unbearable. Unbearable. No parent should have to deal with this. No child should have to deal with this. Three investigators with the Waterville Police Department are on the case. Now, despite the ongoing search for a suspect, they say there's no threat to the public in that area. In Portland, Tyler Cataret, WMW News 8.